New details tonight on a wild story out of Waddell, which is just northwest of the valley. Last week, deputies uncovered a massive underground bunker full of guns, cash, and drugs. Detectives say a mom and son duo were stealing power to run the, the three-story bunker, which they believe was built a decade ago. Emma Lockhart is live in the studio with more on this bizarre story, Emma. Crazy detectives with the Maricopa County Sheriff's Department say they have investigated cases similar to this one, but nothing this elaborate. It's almost like something you see in a movie. A shocking discovery underneath an RV storage facility in Waddell. Maricopa County Sheriff's deputies say they found a three-story bunker made of shipping containers. And we believe that it was built maybe 10 years ago. So it's been there for a while. 61-year-old Laura Swink and her son, 35-year-old Stephen Swink, were accused of stealing power from a nearby APS box. On Tuesday, deputies were serving a search warrant at the hole-in-one RV off 143rd Avenue and Litchfield Road. That's when detectives found the massive bunker packed with illegal drugs, $240,000 in cash, $700,000 worth of gold and silver, along with 36 guns. Sawed off shotguns, rifles manufactured with different lengths, and we've just recently found out that a lot of those weapons are reported stolen. I mean, we're dating back 2013, 2014. Deputies say the mom and son duo were living in the bunker that had bedrooms, a kitchen, and an elevator. Both were arrested and are now facing several charges, including felony theft, criminal damage, and fraud. As more information comes, as we figure out the stolen weapons, the money, the jewelry, then more charges will, will arise. So detectives say they are still investigating what exactly this bunker was being used for, whether or not it was just for storage or there was some type of illegal operation or business with other people involved. Jamie? Emma Lockhart, thank you.